we have a new piece of technology that's going to have to eventually win a race in the algae business. So we're now getting into the field to get it all dialed in. When you go from a small scale to a mid-scale and then trying to get to uh, the first level of an industrial scale, you're going to come across all kinds of challenges, especially in algae of different cultures, different environments, different water conditions. So we're starting in this gorgeous pond here and our intake is just hanging into the water about four inches. That's where we'll be taking the uh, live slurry right from the pond. It goes through a particle filter. In the particle filter, it'll travel up through another pump and into our extraction system. What this is is a proprietary technology where you pump the water algae mix through this device and separating the oil that we need for the chemicals and fuels out of the algae. That's what we call our single step extraction process. We are taking some real life experiments in which we are outside of the lab and getting into what our customers need. In the lab environment here, we can only anticipate what, what challenges we might see. We can't actually feel the real challenges. It's an outdoor pond, there's bugs, there's mud, there's bacteria down at the bottom. And we haven't had that problem here, as you can see in the background here, there's all the clarifiers, they're nice and clean, there's no bugs in there, there's no nothing. They have, at that site, uh, some really robust, healthy algae strains that we can study. They saw our trailer, they saw a very sophisticated computer control system that you would see at a plant level of a wastewater plant or an industrial manufacturing plant. They're also impressed that we could take their slurry right from the pond and process it. Most environments you have to go through several steps before you can start any type of downstream refining. We started right from the pond. There isn't anybody really seriously working on that important technology which is after you've grown the algae and you've formed green water, how do you cost effectively get it into a form where it can go into a refinery? If you can't do that, then the whole thing will come to a grinding halt. And that's something that Origin Oil is doing. I think what's next for us at Origin Oil is now that we are in the field doing these pilot studies, we're going to actually now go after more of these opportunities. And instead of trying to make a big scientific experiment like other guys are doing, we are going to be thinking like agricultural guys, we are going to be thinking like manufacturing guys, we are going to be thinking like people that wants to get the things done and that's going to differentiate us from them.